The material comes inside and is dumped on the floor, is mixed. I enjoy stored. being part of something that's uh, moving forward. David Lang can't speak enough about his recycling and composting facility in Cobble Hill. His eyes light up like a kid in a candy store. I've always enjoyed this industry. It's a challenge. There's uh, never a dull moment, to say the least. Since opening the Fisher Road facility in 2006, he's been doing some major upgrades. When we bought the piece of property, there was two buildings and a very small uh, piece of concrete uh, that was here. We've put in multiple water collection, uh, containment ponds, oil separators, uh, buildings over areas that we work to keep the uh, area more a sealed environment. They recycle a wide range of household waste, including wood, cardboards, batteries, bottles, and tires. But what they're most proud of is the composting section of their facility. We basically take all people's uh, food waste that is developed from home, your breads, your meats, your poultries, uh, cheeses, all that material we accept here. Uh, we mix it with our yard waste that is coming in, which would be your grass clippings, your branches, your leaves, and we mulch it up and we produce a nice quality compost out of it. And one of the big issues they've managed to control is the odor coming out of the whole process. The smell control is issues. We are always m trying to move forward in that realm by building biofilters, um, air, air floors, which are um, uh, concrete floors that put air through the material to keep it oxygenated so it doesn't create more orders. We have covered a lot of the area of where we operate and then other outside areas we have put um, concrete pads and water control systems in to collect all the rainwater that hits the material and goes to a le leachate collection ponds and then we actually take the water that is um, runoff and reuse it back in our composting system to create a closed loop system. The facility also manages a lot of its own waste. Some of our waste, like cardboard and stuff, we actually use to produce dirt out of it instead of sending it across seas. All the wood waste we receive here then is now gone to produce power up at local mills. Compost is gives the ability for the region to have some good quality topsoil. Lang says he's always looking for more avenues to improve the facility. He's optimistic that one day he'll be able to produce his own power, helping reduce everyone's footprint for generations to come. In Cobble Hill for Shaw TV, I'm Dunia Tozzi.